Welcome to Sauce Labs, where we test at the speed of awesome. Sauce Labs provides the world's largest continuous testing cloud for running Selenium, Appium, Espresso, and XCUI test scripts. And Sauce Labs gives you access to more than 800 browser OS combinations, nearly 200 emulators and simulators, and more than 2,000 real devices. In this video, we'll show you how easy it is to run your existing test script on the Sauce Labs continuous testing cloud. Once you've created your Sauce Labs account, you'll need to update your test script with the following information. First is your Sauce Labs username and access key. Your username is the name you use to create your Sauce Labs account, and you can find your Sauce Labs access key in your account dashboard under the My Account section. Next, you'll need to add a section to create a remote web driver instance. This is the object that connects your test to the Sauce Cloud and sends you test commands. Finally, you'll need to add your desired capabilities. This is the combination of test API, device, browser, and operating system you want to test against. Sauce Labs makes this very easy for you with our platform configurator. You can choose the Selenium or Appium API, PC or Mac, operating system, and browser. For this test, we'll choose Selenium, running on a PC with Windows 10, and Firefox version 58.0. The platform configurator generates code snippets in a variety of programming languages, including Java, PHP, Node.js, Python, and more. We'll use the Java code, so we'll click Copy, switch back to our IDE, and paste the code into our test script. You can also include additional desired capabilities, like your test name, test status, and build number, to help streamline your test reporting and manage jobs with a CI server like Jenkins. And that's it! Your test script is ready to run on Sauce Labs. We'll kick off our own test, then switch back to the Sauce Labs dashboard, where we can see multiple virtual machines spinning up to run our tests and the tests starting to run in parallel. Once a test is completed, you can watch a video recording of the entire session, which is a great way to ensure that your code does exactly what you want it to do. You can also click the Commands tab to see the details of every Selenium command, along with a corresponding screenshot showing the results of each command. You can also view the entire Selenium log file, or look at the Selenium server and automator logs. And the Metadata tab lets you view all the available test information, which you can also access via the Sauce Labs REST API, so you can create your own reports and dashboards. Sauce Labs also offers robust reporting tools that help you analyze and debug your tests more quickly. Analytic trends let you quickly see aggregated test data and filter data by date ranges, users, operating system, and browsers. You can see graphical representations of recent tests over time, your testing pass-fail rates, and errors by frequency, plus complete build and test statistics. Trend data can be filtered down to five-second intervals, so you can easily tell if your applications are release ready. The Trend tab is also a good place to compare how individual teams are performing or how your builds are progressing. Test Insights gives you the information you need to easily identify unstable or flaky tests. The Test Insights color-coded graph shows test run variability for individual sessions, so you can more easily spot issues. There's also data to identify the shortest and longest run times, which can be filtered by a variety of different dimensions. Adapting an existing Selenium script to run the Sauce Labs Continuous Testing Cloud is fast and easy, and Sauce Labs lets you test more frequently and faster and with more reliable results without the headache and costs of setting up and maintaining your own internal test grid or device lab. Sign up for a free trial of Sauce Labs today and start running your tests at the speed of awesome.